He's has signaled that he's going to uh, take money that's been appropriated for National Guard units and drug interdiction and reassign it for himself to keep a campaign pledge to build a wall. No matter what people think about that particular goal of his, it violates separation of powers doctrine. Uh, it, uh, you know, it, it penalizes states who've made plans for the money that's already been appropriated, uh, and it's improper uh, use of his authority. Well, the first thing that it would do for Minnesota is it would obliterate the idea of what a real emergency is. I mean, we know emergencies here. We've had tornadoes, we've had floods, we've had crises that we've had to deal with in which in invocation of emergency powers was proper and, and authorized. Never before has somebody just flagrantly done this for political purposes and political gain. The other thing it would do to harm Minnesota is it uh, very well could and is likely to uh, reappropriate funds that we've decided to use uh, based on congressional approval to use in a certain way that, that he's simply going to uh, take that away uh, and reappropriate them in a way that is beneficial to his political